We've had students from all over Scotland here, from Aberdeen, from Edinburgh, from Ayrshire and from Dundee, the whole lot and it's just been fantastic. I'm at Dundee and Angus College studying acting and performance. Come New College now. Lanarkshire yeah. coming old. It's a television production at Glasgow Kelvin College. Air College. Um, Air College, yeah. yeah. We had buses coming from Aberdeen with students, we had buses coming from Edinburgh, uh, we had people coming from Dundee on the train and they thought they'd lost their tickets. You know, there's all that kind of thing that scares you to death when you're an event organiser because there's so many things that could go wrong. So when I actually saw those first two sessions go up this morning, I was over the moon because I thought, we're started, we're doing it, it's great. They get rushes of thought and then nothing. They always keep the life in their eyes. They do things that we as actors really need to observe and know about. The workshop this morning from Mel Churcher uh, was a wonderful opportunity for the students, an opportunity that really they wouldn't get otherwise because coming all the way from Aberdeen to Glasgow is one thing but there's no way we would be able to go and see her in London. Mel Churcher's workshop was really good, um, I find it really interesting to find out how you, like directors can work with actors and get them to actually really feel the scene rather than just make it sound like they're reading from a script. I was an actor for about 20 years and then I started teaching in drama schools which I did on and off for about 10 years. Um, Luke Besson needed somebody for Mira Jojovic in a film called The Fifth Element and then it kind of snowballed. For an actor I would say you have to put yourself in the moment Really, it should be like when you were five and you believed, you just need to do that again. And for a director, I would say you need to help them believe. Not just say the lines, but find reasons for them to say them. I thought it was really interesting, like very informative, but I've never actually like, looked at my actors the way. Yeah, I've I never have, thought like, of my yeah. actors like that either. I've just kind of, as she was saying, like, re <laughs> read it and if it yeah, sounds okay, exactly. then that's, that'll do. <laughs> Days like these are fantastic, they're great opportunities as well for students to really come on board regardless of what year they're in get hands on experience. It's a really fantastic day and it's been a great venue to do it. We've got this marketplace behind me here and we've got lots of kit in and it was great to give the students the opportunity to actually see all that. So I've, no, I've never seen half the equipment that we've seen today, like half the cameras and stuff. Really interesting. Like. Um, during lunch was able to go over to Visual Impact and have a look on their new rig and do a bit of that. So that was fun. I saw people come around with all sorts of strange cameras and weird things, but they obviously were having that opportunity to see the new things and, and, and I think that's great. I'm just over the moon. I think we've had a great day. We've had great people. We've had very, very good sessions with, run by really professional people who really know what they're talking about and they've got loads of experience. So I think, on the whole, I think we've done a good job. I'm feeling quite pleased, I have to say.